today looks like a very, very beautiful sunny day. I love it. What are you eating there? It's actually crazy how dark it gets. Like, anyway, we're off to be setting the library for the millionth time already this week. So about, I would say about like 30 minutes ago, or about maybe 45 minutes ago, uh, these two, I guess, people that watch my videos came up to me as I'm, as I'm studying. Uh, and, they, and they said that they enjoyed my videos and that they watched them. And I just, I kind of wanted to say, well, for everybody else that recognizes me on campus, come say hi, I'm, I love talking to you. And Subscriber Sunday, Woo! Um, So as you guys know, every single Sunday I'd answer your questions that you guys submit in the comment section down below. You always seem on the go and get so much done. How do you manage to do it all on days you are tired or don't feel the greatest? To be honest, I definitely do feel tired a lot and I feel tired all the time. My work at the bank as an advisor and then doing the, the daily vlog and then having the school stress kind of loom all the time. In terms of how I get stuff done, there's just, there's no secret sauce and it's just about getting it done. For me, like for this daily vlog, for example, it's my top priority every single day to get it done. Um, so, you know, I might be busy all the way up until 11 p.m., 12 a.m. at night, but I'm still gonna get this vlog uploaded and done and I'll not go to bed till like 5, 6 a.m. I've talked about this a lot in my channel and what it comes down to is setting what your priorities are and making it the number one thing you get done every single day. There's no, there's no secret formula or sauce to, to being consistent and, and getting stuff done. It's just, what laptop do you use and how's your experience with the Pixel 3 long term and after the review? The laptop I use is the... Ow! God! Dell XPS 15, it has 16 gigabytes of RAM, it has a dedicated Intel NVIDIA GTX 1050, 2 gigabytes of dedicated video memory I believe, and then there's 256 gigabytes of SSD in here. This thing is, a, is an editing beast. I love it. My favorite laptop. Definitely would recommend this to anybody. In terms of my in terms of my experience with the Pixel 3, uh, this thing still runs very well. I've had no slowdown, no lag, and the battery life is top notch. Dude, are you in West Toronto? No, I, I live in live in Guelph, Ontario. But thanks for asking. What's your recommendation on good coffee? I don't I don't drink coffee, so I don't. I like tea though. I really really love tea. My favorite tea is the pumpkin spice one from David's Tea as well as the hot chocolate. Both highly caffeinated equivalents of coffee, if that kind of answers your question. What's your favorite headphones? To be honest, my favorite headphones, I don't own them, but if I could buy any headphones in the world, it would be the Bose, it would be the Bose Sound Comfort, Comfort Sound. Aaron, love your vlogs. My wife is going to grad school next fall at U of G. Could you please share some tips around living slash studying in Guelph? My experience in terms of living, uh, the cheapest way to live obviously in any city is to find roommates. You you can find rooms here in Guelph for as cheap as like $400 to as expensive as like $700, $800. Um, so definitely shop around. There's there's deals everywhere and and make sure you pick the right roommates. You know, I've seen that person, you have, to, you have to live with them for the next eight months or 12 months, however long your lease is. So make it a top priority to not live with people that you find annoying. In terms of studying, there's tons of options to study in, in any city. You can go to any cafe that's in Guelph. You can also go to the library or on campus, but just keep in mind that on campus, you can get very, very busy, so you might have trouble actually finding some study space on there. I typically think that it works better to study at home or, or just to study outside of campus during the peak hours. What's your New Year's resolution? To be honest with you, I don't like those things, but if I had to pick one, it would be to consistently wake up every single day at 4 a.m. I'm obsessed with trying to 
consistently wake up in the morning. It's currently 12.01 a.m. She has officially turned 21. Yeah. But she's sleeping, so we're gonna have to wake her up. Birthday to you. Ha happy birthday. Happy birthday to you. Um, your good friends. I don't know the lyrics. I have to say about turning 21. What's well, 9 plus 10? 21? You stupid! It's gonna be easy. I like a little challenge. When it feels better, when you take a little damage. Slow, learn it faster.